This started out as a job and ended up to be a career path. I mean, I, when I first started working here, I didn't think I'd be here after 31 years. And it's just turned into a career. An operator watches over the equipment and the process in a, in a facility. They take measurements and readings, make sure the equipment is operating properly, that the organisms are doing their job, so we have a safe product to do, put out into the stream. Being a water treatment plant operator is hands-on. Um, you really have to pay attention to what you're doing and the surroundings, and you learn actually being here. Come in and check our pressures and our tanks, and we start up our raw intake. Then we go through our treatment process by checking all of our chemicals and making sure they're properly filled and all the pumps are working correctly. And then we do water tests throughout the day to make sure that our chemicals are reacting the way they should and that our water is being produced at the highest quality it can be made. You need mechanical aptitude, you need mathematics, you need science, common sense, because you use it all when you're in the job. Be smelling for strange odors, they'll be looking for things that are, that are strange, listening for things, um, and in the process they do troubleshooting to make sure things, if they're not quite right, functioning properly, what's, what's going on with them. A lot of chemistry and a lot of algebra. Uh, we use formulas throughout the day very heavily. Uh, everything we have has a formula to it, and you can't really figure anything out unless you have a formula to get that final answer. We like to bring somebody in as a as a trainee with no real knowledge. I mean, they, they, it'd be nice if they have some math and science background, but we bring them in and we, we take them under our wing and we train them all the way up and, and if they take schooling or we provide some, t some uh, instruction and get their licenses and train them here on the job. But there are some courses out there where you can take all the courses to get a degree in water and mace water management and then you have the skill set to get to find a, a job. I just recently got certified. I'm a class three operator. I had to go through four, four days, three days of schooling. The fourth day was test day. Um, it was a hundred question test and it was over regulations, uh, treatment process and everything that pertained to it thereafter. I love my job, I really do. My job, it, it's a good job that you can count on not going nowhere. It's a job that you can feel proud of at the end of the day. Uh, you can, you know that at the end of the day you're keeping other kids and other families safe. I mean, I have a family of my own and I want to make sure that they're getting the best water possible and I like to make sure everybody else is getting the same opportunity. We're protecting one of man's most important resources and that's water. We're looking at, we're guardians of the environment the best we can.